So apparently panhandling or begging for money has moved from the streets to TikTok. Let's get into it. Hey guys, I'm just coming on here to ask for like a couple dollars because my kids have no shoes and like we have no food and I have no car. Are you working? No, I'm not working. I don't have a car and I have poor kids and no babysitter. Find a babysitter. Hello, no job, no money, no babysitter. Why don't you go down and get assistance? Assistance? Um, I don't have any way there. And who's gonna watch the kids when I go? I cannot take four kids down to try to get assistance. Can you ask your family members for help? No, I don't have any family members. They're all in different states and they don't care about me or my kids. I'm not asking for much. I'm just asking for a little bit of money for me and my kids. What is wrong with you guys? You guys are so insensitive. Why do you think that you can be rude and have people help you? I'm not being rude. You're being rude by not helping me. Like, hello? My cash app is in my bio. What? My nails are done because my friend got them done for me. If you're not going to send me any money, you can just scroll. I'm like stranded. I'm out of gas. My phone's off. Uh, the phone bill and the tablet is 60. And to fill my car up, um, I already got 20, so 20 more dollars. So about 80, about $80. Hawaiian Punch, Captain Crunch, Penny Ferry. Wow, I just got a notification from PayPal, right? And someone sent me a penny. Penny Ferry time, yeah, what is that? Penny Ferry time, that's who sent me the penny. What is the penny, what is the penny ferry? What is that? So the penny ferry gives a penny? It's 2024. What am I gonna do with that penny? Why do people do that? Why do they do that? I don't understand that. Come on, y'all gotta keep tapping that screen. Tap that screen. I love you, queen. Love don't pay the bills, baby. Send me an ice cream or get out the live. Come on, you guys gotta smash that like button. Smash that like button thank you chrissy see chrissy's the only one that's sending gifts what's wrong with y'all 600 people in this live and only one person is sending gifts y'all just mad useless like what we having a staring competition like come on now user one welcome user one two three i hope you have some money because this live ain't free it costs money to view me come on keep tapping that screen Sent you a rose. I said, I said galaxies, galaxies. What y'all broke? I need to get some jobs for real. I don't see nobody sending gifts. We just having a straight up staring contest. See, I don't Mommy. Brush here. You see when I'm working, you don't come in the room, right? I'm hungry. I want some chips. Top shelf. Mm. I got a good taste for tacos, y'all. Y'all trying to give me some tacos? Oh, where are my mods at? Where are my mods at? No, mod, y'all not doing y'all job, mods. Come on. Listen, I need seven more likes. Seven more likes and I will cut all my hair off. Is seven likes? 700 more likes and I'll cut all my hair up. Seven thousand more likes and I'll cut all my hair off. Mommy! What's right here? What? There are no more chips. K 
Keep tapping that screen. Tap that screen. They ain't send me nothing. They tell me when they got five dollars. I need Work fifty at least. I need. I know Who, I'm. Who broke? I know I'm broke. That's why I'm asking y'all for help. No, we ain't broke. We just. No, nah, bro, we ain't broke. We okay, but we still need our shit paid. So we need to tell them that we broke. That's supposed to take care of some accountability. If we broke, fix us. If you can't give me fifty guns on that, nah, baby, you need to get Why are you going to lie? The lie title literally says, "Help me, please, dear God, I need the help today." Come on now. Why are you here? I like, come on, bro. We the only niggas with bills that you know. Come on now. Y'all need... watching us? They ain't. Tell them. Help! 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 Look, hold on. You need a job. This is my job. Actually, y'all for money. Help me. Y'all is my job. Send me money. Why y'all always asking for money? I ain't always asking for money. I just consecutively ask. I, I'm just habitually asking. That's it. Come on now. I ain't always asking nothing. Yeah, we're just asking with persistence. That's Come it, on, bro. that's it. Habitually asking for help, bro. Obviously, these two are not good at panhandling because they can't even agree on whether they're broke or not. Nobody sent none. Tuh. And I'm, I'm gonna make that fucking clear. No, because nobody has sent no shit to us. To our no, I'm just crew, gonna be. I, I, no I'm disrespect. just saying. I'm sorry, y'all bitches got us fucked up. They be, they be really you trying be, to talk to like down somebody funding us our life. And nobody no, sent nothing. No. These past couple of days, the days we were off, the days we were off live for them four days. These past couple of days that we've been on, this is day three we've been on live. Nobody has sent nothing. The comments no. been on. Our, our cash app hasn't even been up. Well, it, nobody's been sending nothing like that. Honestly, no. Nobody sent nothing. And I can tell you one person that did send $10, wasn't right. it? Yeah. Yeah, somebody sent $10 for lunch. Yeah. The When was this, like yesterday, the day before? No. That was the, only yesterday. When yesterday. I checked, I was like, oh, right. And that's okay. it. Somebody sent $10 for lunch. That's and that it. was it. But um, as far as hotel money, no. as far as gas, no. as far as, like, food, food that we need in water. Because we're grown. Because we do what, what we... we I'm just I'm letting like, y'all know we do what we have to do because right. we are grown-ass women, right. like y'all keep saying. Right. Um, nobody has sent us mm -hmm. anything, a dime, besides the $10 that somebody sent for lunch yesterday. And we were very appreciative of Yes, that. and we thank that person for right. that. But I just um, didn't message her back because... It, it's a lot going. It was a lot going. Right, on. but we think but she, that person for that. She knows. Um, but other than that, nobody has sent nothing to us for a hotel or nothing. Mm -mm. And I'm sorry, I'm just making it clear because y'all bitches got be having us fucked up. They do. Like they we be beggars talking and scammers shit. and talking shit. And some of y'all supporters do too. No, they do. Let be me be uh, In them sorry. Comments. Sorry, I'm sorry. Honestly, I don't give a fuck no more. Some of y'all supporters be in them fucking comments. Yes. Talking. Since everybody want to talk, but we beggars and Did y'all hear about the lady that needs $4,000 by next month so that way she can move into her new apartment and is trying to raise the money by having people give her roses on live? So I need to come up with $4,000 by April 20th in order to secure a cheaper apartment that I'm looking into. I saw someone else do this on TikTok with their student debt. She went live and everybody donated roses and she was able to pay off $20,000 in student debt. I think one rose counts as a dollar, so if I get 4,000 roses, I can move into my apartment. Now, since she's posted that video, it's gotten over 22 million views and over a million likes. This is her page in case y'all wanna follow her. I do wonder if she was monetized prior to posting that video. I assume she wasn't because that video wasn't long enough to qualify for rewards, but if she were monetized, man, she could have hit her goal off of that one video alone. Regardless, people are tuning into her lives, y'all, and are giving her roses. She's being showered with roses and quite literally being given her flowers. And it looks like Miss Aura here started a movement because now other people are posting videos asking for users to support their lives so that way they can pay off their debts as well. What are our thoughts on this? I know people have been calling for this to be a movement for a while now, that we should all come together and pay off each other's debts by everybody donating a dollar. However, some people consider this cyber begging and are questioning why we should give money to this user or anybody else that does this when quite frankly, all of us are broke. I'm at $49 if anybody likes to donate towards 200, 100 for the room, 100 for the car. I'm at $49 and I've been stuck there. Y'all see all these demons and lurking spirits. So when God is ready, he will send someone through. Now y'all see when I had it open, y'all seen all them demons and lurking spirits, all them zero follower accounts, zero following, those are demons. And y'all see them all up in here still, right? Okay, I beg for money. But I feel as though when I beg, it's perfectly normal. Like, I just turned 18. Y'all feel me? There's nothing wrong with a, a brand new adult begging for money. 
So, I'm basically just going to talk about how I feel about older, older people begging for money. Like, I'm talking about 30s, 40s. Okay. So, I feel like the max cutoff for people begging should be 21. Because that's when you have officially have had three years of experience being an adult. You are now officially grown. That's my opinion. When you reach 21, that's when you're actually grown. So, when you finally hit 21, you need to stop begging. Because at that point, you've had three years, girl. You should now be able to afford whatever you need, etc. Have your own coins. So, I feel like that should be the max cutoff. So, if I see anybody above the age of 21 asking for help or dollars, I feel as though, no. Especially when they have kids. Because then it's like, girl, no. You shouldn't be asking for dollars. At that point, you just need to need to monetize your own content. That's what you need to do. You need to stop asking people for dollars if you're not going to be able to help you and your child. If you and your child or children, plural, multiple kids, are living with you in their house and you're asking for dollars and you're above the age of 21, I'm having an issue with that. Stop it. Cut it out. It's not cute. But at the end of the day, um, I do beg for money, and I will stop begging for money by the time I am 21, because that's when I will officially be grown, and yeah. Hey, y'all, just on here trying to get some, uh, raise some money so I can get me and my kids something to eat and pay my rent. How many kids do you got? Oh, I got six kids. Yeah, I got six kids. Um... I was staying with my auntie, but she put me out. Now I'm staying with a friend, and she charging me to be here. So uh, me and all my kids is in one room, and um, it's kind of on me to kind of have food for them and stuff like that. Where your kids' daddy at? You got six of them. Why is that the first thing y'all ask somebody when they come on here asking for help is where their kids' father's at? Clearly they ain't in the picture. So that's why I'm asking for help. Go donate, go donate plasma or something. Y'all always coming on TikTok begging. Well, first of all, I didn't ask you for anything. I just posted my cash up and said what I need help with. It's y'all being my comments being so negative and that's sad. People really be out here struggling and need help and all y'all be doing is being negative to us. We sick of all you motherfuckers coming on here begging. Go get a job. We all struggling. Where's my mods at? Somebody blocked this person. Come on now. I made y'all mods for a reason. Y'all letting these people up in here saying anything. Won't you go apply for food stamps? I know you get a whole bunch. You got all them fucking kids. Uh, first of all, I, I'm trying to get food stamps. I just said my granny put me out, and now I'm staying with my friend, and I'm trying to get all my paperwork together because I had to go down there with birth certificates and all that, and that's what I was asking for help for the other day because I don't have the money to even even try to get my kids birth certificates and socials. Brother, ugh. So who was really out here getting Shrek pregnant? Now, I mean, I don't doubt that she has six kids, I'm just shocked that someone, that six people went through the process of making six kids with her. But then again, men out here will, will uh, screw anything with legs. Hopefully you guys don't fall for this stuff because the vast majority of these people are scammers and con artists and they're just looking for a free ride. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. We'll see y'all next time.